see, I was on Wall Street for 10 years. <laughs> Pretty good at it, I might add. One day I walked into the office and I saw my friend and partner grabbing at his chest in agony. I dialed 911. The medics came, rushed him to the hospital. He was only 28 years old. I'm sorry. No, just a bad case of gas from the burrito <laughs> <laughs> He who dies with the most wins. Oftentimes, literally so. Then he who wants to enjoy life takes some time off. I'm just sorry it took me ten years to realize. So how does a Wall Street big shot end up to be a plumber? Well, my high school buddy's dad was a plumber. I used to help him out. Figures that I, uh, I could use in my hands. <laughs> After I got my MBA, I followed my dad's footsteps to Wall Street. Once reality hit, I reprioritized my life. I decided to use my MBA and my hands. Now I have five trucks, seven full-time employees. I haven't looked back since. Well, that was a big leap of faith. Sometimes in life, you just you gotta take a chance. <laughs> 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 if you never take a chance, if you always have to read, you never see another man who could use a helping hand, only trying to succeed. If you never have to try, just too easy to get by, never take a challenge, always on the fringe, sell it something you can buy. You never make a new design. <laughs> Living in the now and here, nothing that's sincere. You will leave your life behind. If you're always feeling blue, then there's nothing you can do. <coughs> Take another chance, evaluate your stance. Ask the love to help you through. Time to take a chance. See a chance and fail a need. Give your life into his hands, make his all he demands. You don't always have to leave. No, no, no. 